Can, can you guys explain what happened defensively uh, on their last possession? Um, Tate made a tough shot. Um, you know, he's known for making those tough shots, and I thought we played good defense. He just made a tough shot. Tony, it seems like they want the ball in your hands uh, when it gets down to the stretch. Uh, what does it feel like to have that your team have that confidence in you? Uh, it's a great feeling just knowing that my teammates and my coach mainly has that confidence in me. And, you know, the uh, the final deciding play that we had on offense, Chef actually made the decision and made the play, and I was I was just trying to be a good teammate and get open. So it just it just means that um, it just means a whole lot to me knowing that they trust me. Making those end of game decisions. Um, along the same lines, um, how do you approach those last minute shots? Like, how do you keep your calm? Um, what sort of mindset do you have in those last few seconds? Uh, uh, I just I'm trusting my instincts. I've been playing I've been playing basketball all my life on uh, all types of different stages. So I just kind of just tell myself at the end of the day, as I'm just a game of basketball. You want you want to take the shot or you not? You're the shot or you not. I don't try to put any extra pressure on myself. Shep, you guys have had six really, really close games by a possession or overtime uh, in the Big Ten. You've come out on the losing end five times. W what do you think is kind of separating you guys from getting over the hump in those types of games? Um, I think I think we're playing. Um, I think we're playing great. I think you know. Sometimes you know teams make certain plays and we don't. I mean, that's, that's just what it comes down to. Um, but they're all learning experiences. You know, we take every game as a learning experience, win or loss. So, you know, we're going to come back um, to practice and look at the film and get better, learn from this, and get ready for Iowa on Sunday. For, for what it's worth, is, is there anything that you feel like you you have learned or that, and Tony, you can weigh in too if you want, but, I mean, what what lessons have you taken away from these types of games? I think mostly is... Um, defending and rebounding, that's what's going to get it done um, in these close games. I think in the Big Ten, um, there's a lot of possession basketball, so um, the more stops you get, the better chances you have at winning those close games. So that's what it's going to come down to, getting stops. How much do you guys miss Mike on that last possession? Nothing against Julian or Lamar who were down there, but Mike obviously has been a special shot blocker for your team this year. Um... We we definitely missed him, um, but you know he's he was cramping, um, he's been he was cramping all game, so you know I respect Mike a lot for fighting through that. That's, I know that's tough. I've been in that position before too, um, but you know they got the best of him, so um, you know it is what it is. I mean we next man up. I thought we played great defense on that last play again. Like tough made a tough. Sh I mean Tate made a tough shot, so I mean we gotta live with it.